Hi guys, this is your girl Hawaii and I'm coming to you with a quick wig review, a uh, haul um, that I'm going to be doing. I'm going to be doing a review, uh, Just this is just going to be a show and tell review first and I will do a thorough review as soon as I can. Um, I will let you guys know. I just received this eye review on and the first thing I'm going to start off with is the hair and um this is uh a review for a company i'm gonna post everything below uh, all the information below if you're interested in looking into purchasing these products okay now all products were sent to me to review for free okay they asked me i'm gonna give you my honest and true going review when i get this hair installed or have it done and I will post it on how the hair texture stays, how it works out, and um, what, and more to go with it. I'm sorry. Um, so let's go ahead, and I'm gonna explain to you. What I it came in this bag, DHL. Um, received it today. Okay. It was shipped on the, I believe the sixth, and I got it today. It was actually it only took three or four days shipping since they had to go through another state to get to um, where I'm at. They had to go to the mm -hmm. in the Louisiana the dispatch or whatever. These are all three bundles. And these are um, in the color 9, 99J. This is the color. It's like burgundy. Burgundy. I'll say burgundy. And um, the length of hair I bought was, um, bought, I'm sorry, that was sent to me were I uh, think two 18 inches and one 20 inch. Um, and this says on the tab to be 100% Indian, 100% Indian hair on the tab here. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. But this is very, okay. I measured the hair myself and some of them are turning out to be the correct size. Um, with the hair being shrunk and it stretched, it'll be a little bit like 20 to maybe 18 to 20 inches in length. It's a wavy um, texture, um, and like I said, it's in the color 99J from um, Ally Express. Uh, yeah, that's it. Ally Express. I do apologize for the wrong the beginning. I will post everything below so you guys can know exactly what I mean. Um, so they are. Uh, sent me these three bundles. I'm planning on having them probably installed. Um, I'm not sure when, but I will keep you guys updated and posted on this hair. Um, let me show you the one that I undid. This is the one that I undid. And it's a, like I said, I got it in a three bundle. Because so I'm pretty sure that it's not going to take no more than three bundles for my hair. Um, this is the hair. I'm going to copy the name the beginning. I will post everything below so you guys can know exactly what I mean. Um, so they uh, sent me these three bundles. I'm planning on having them probably installed. Um, I'm not sure when, but I will keep you guys updated and posted on this hair. Um, let me show you the one that I undid. This is the one that I undid. And it's a, like I said, I got it in a three bundle. That it's not going to take no more than three bundles for my hair. Um, this is the hair, um, and ladies, I'm going to be honest with you, I'm not a, a beautician or anything, so I don't know how to do any sew-ins or nothing like that. I know how to work with wigs and comb my natural hair, but I've never had, uh, I've never done a sew-in on myself, so I'm going to probably have it professionally done or have somebody that I know that knows how to install the part wig from this hair. And I'll probably have them do it here. Um, so that you guys can probably see it on camera, maybe go from there. I will, I will keep you guys updated. Um, it's going to be a minute before I can get it all situated because right now I'm still going, we're still having some um, things that we're trying to get done and take care of. But this here is the hair, and this is how it pattern goes here. It's uh, folded up, so let me open it up all the way. This is the hair. All the way out to here, okay. It was folded up, okay. And this is here, it is folded together. This is the weft of everything, and all of that. 
me show you guys. And I will also share with you if there's any shedding or anything like that. He said it would be safe to use heat, styling products, anything for this hair. Um, again, this hair is a 100% Indian hair. Um, as stated on the tab. Um, like I said, this is my first time doing a review for a uh, hair company for, ex you know, like extensions. I've done a review for a wig, but out of uh, this first time, because I hadn't had a sew-in in quite some time. And it's been a while since I had a sew-in in my hair. I think the last sew I had in was back in 09, maybe 08, that time length. Um, I hadn't had my hair um, done like that professionally. Um, I usually just, you know, keep my natural hair washed. Then if I don't want to wear it, I wear a wig. Same, same thing. So yes, these are three bundles of Indian, 100% Indian hair. The quality, the hair is so soft. Um, I'm looking for shedding, anything for that matter, um, while I'm running my hair through it. I am planning on having it installed in my hair or having a U-part wig made from it because I'm I truly don't know nothing about any type of stuff like that. I personally would want to get done professional so I know that it'll be done right in a more professional style. Just being a dumb. Also with there, it's very beautiful. I mean it, it it's like take it would just these Right here, three bones along mixed together. It's, it's not thick on one link because it is kind of thin. Not too thin, but just kind of a, it's a thin texture. But I'm pretty sure if you add layer on layer, this is what it would look like if I had it on my head. I love this color. It's really beautiful. And, um, yeah, I wanted to get you guys, you can think if you, uh, have any ideas of what how high I should have it installed should I get a U part or should I have a sewing um, you comment below let me know so moving right along I will get back with the hair um as soon as I get it done I will come on camera and if, if I do a tutorial um, or having somebody doing it or installing it I'll give you guys updates I will keep you posted on that again that's the hair it's a uh, hundred percent Human, I'm sorry, 100% Indian hair in the color 99J. And um, they also sent me this. Everything came packaged very well. I'm going to tell you what. Uh, the hair came in separate packages. Every bundle came in a different package. It came in separate packages like this. That's what the hair came in. Also, they sent me a palette. An 88 palette. There's no name on it. It's basically um, it's a makeup palette. Um, pretty sure you guys have seen these colors once and more times before. But a very beautiful palette. This is the palette they sent me as well. I will be doing some looks from this palette because mine did break, as you know. This palette here. They sent me this. And it come with a little uh, protective paper on it, as well as a mirror and two sponge applicators um, as well and I will definitely let you guys know how this palette works with me as well and yeah they sent this to me and they also sent me oh my goodness guys excuse me for a minute everything came packaged in bubble wrap everything is nicely neatly packaged and I uh, really am impressed by that so well done with the packaging Okay, and the next thing, oh, I'm missing something here. Okay, let's see. They sent me a
21 a 21 brush set and this here is a bag it came in and here are the brushes that you see they sent me a and Lord knows I needed a brush set. Y'all don't know how oh, my brushes were breaking. And this here is the brush set. Okay. Um, they don't have any names on any particular brushes or anything. It's a uh, really nice. So far, um, I'm just going to just take them out little by little, like a blush brush, powder brush here, and they all packaged. It's got the little protective thing on it. This is the big fan brush. It's protected on it as well. Okay. And came with a little packaging. Back in there. And another little brush here uh, that's got a protect on it as well. And that's this little brush here. I'm pretty sure you can use this for blush or whatever but brushes here I would basically use for blush or um there's another little brush that also comes like a real they're real soft brushes real kind of brushes I mainly would use this for just powder um uh applicants you know applications and stuff because these are not like foundation brush type of brushes or anything I wouldn't even use this as a foundation brush it's not sturdy enough for a foundation brush if that makes sense and here is another brush similar a smaller brush you could probably use you can probably get away with little you know whatever on your face but it's a little small one okay protect the brush for the package. Also, we got like I would say this is a probably a concealer brush um, here. Another one, maybe a smaller. It's kind of a medium size brush here as well. Okay, real soft. And this one's a little sturdy. So was the other one as well. And here is a smaller version of that brush. And you probably use this as a. Um, you can probably use that to get underneath the uh, eyes, brows to do seal or whatever. And a smaller version, a tiny version, maybe to apply uh, makeup eyeshadow with. Okay. Again, they don't have any names on them or what they're used for, so you can probably use them to have you, your however you want to. Basically, different size, same type of brush. You can use this probably for eyeshadow. We got a small fan brush here. It's like a little small mini fan. You, you can probably use this as a fine uh, blush or highlight or whatever that you use. Um, getting a little bit of. I got the um the finer brush. Got this brush here. You can probably use this for maybe lip apply application or on your eyes. Here's an angle, you know, a little small brush you can use to apply liner or perhaps uh, do a cut crease. It's not an angle brush, but it's kind of a small brush you can just use. Real tiny thing. Okay. That whatever, and here this is an angle brush, it's a small angle brush you can use as well. This is the angle because you can see the shape, and you see the shape of the brush it goes up. Real soft brushes, the bristles are very, very, um, uh, how would I say this? They're very 
they're not they're not stiff but they're not soft either they're just like the way you want them. but if after applications are applying on whatever how it depends on how they hold up so i've never used their brushes before the first time so we're going to also do a test and review on these as well here is another small size brush you can use for your eyes or your lips and another angle brush small angle brush you can use okay. you can use that to do a cut crease round and this here okay now we're getting some more this could this right here could be a lip brush a liner brush whatever you want to add this for it's a real tiny tiny brush i don't know if you guys can see that or not my lighting sucks a little lip liner brush whatever you can use that as well it's a really good it's a real small brush so you could probably use it for a um a liner applying a liquid or gel eyeliner on your lid so i would suggest that because it's real small and it's made for a liner okay i'm glad i got this i have to go and look for one um you also get a sponge applicator it's like a sponge applicator on this brush real sponge okay and i got the last two brushes i'm going to pull both these out you got a a brush in the brow set as well as a curling wand to brush your brows and shape it the way you want them when you either um trim them trim uh, excuse me trimming the brows you can have on your brush also when you're doing your makeup or whatever you can use a super brush your brows in the shape you want them to go in okay same thing applies to this the same thing it's just basic you got a mascara type of brush you got a, a brush and comb and uh eyebrow, eyebrow eyebrow brush sorry guys my words are getting much twisted today and yeah so it came in this packaging here shipped really quickly very friendly people um that have any issues with anything they sent to me sent all the stuff wrapped extremely well um i'm really grateful to do this review for them i'm very thankful to be able to get you ladies information um and help you ladies find the things that make make um that for your desire if you're interested in purchasing any hair from this company they're they're not ex they're not expensive there's really reasonable prices and everything so you can get a great amount of hair for a good bundle uh, a good deal like i said this was sent to me to do a review on i'm just giving you my honest review um like i said everything you see me show you or um have given to you on this video there will be another video when i get the hair installed and also me doing looks from my new makeup brush set as well as the palette so i can a live review to show you what works and what don't work if i like it if i don't like it if something i don't like now all the brushes are nice the only thing i would recommend if they got a more stiffer foundation brush in that palette because those softer brushes are not really foundation brushes they're mainly for basically blush uh all kind of a matted powder type of whatever you want to use it for but me personally i don't think those brushes are meant for putting applying foundation on your face um now where is it? Uh, like something like this, I would recommend them to add. This is a color, whatever you want to use it for. But me personally, I don't think those brushes are meant for putting applying foundation on your face. Um, now, where is it? Uh, like something like this, I would recommend them to add. This is a color. Like these type of brush, stilts like stilts like this brush. This is what I would recommend if they want um, more detail, you know, to add more detail to their brush sets. 
So I suggest that they get something like this, a more stiffer brush where you can put your foundation on. This is a really nice kit and I'm thankful for it and I'm glad I got this because I tell you all my brushes were breaking. Look at here, this has got tape on my brush and this is my favorite brush to use to apply my foundation. I just recently found one of my foundation brushes today that came with this kit and it's really really one of my second favorite brushes to apply in my foundation. I didn't use this one, I used the other brush. I'll show you guys in the um, tutorial. Um, it's going over there right now. But this here is a great set to have. It's just like I wish they would put in a sturdier and more stronger foundation brush in this kit. Um, but really nice set and I'm thankful and I'm grateful for it. Thank you. Um, so I'm very, I'm just LA Express. I'm very grateful for this review. I will do a full and thorough review. If I'm able to do a hair tutorial install, I will try to do that. It won't be no time for the next two weeks or so, depending on money-wise, because you know people are going to want money to do the hair, of course. But I want to make sure I have all the things I need before I get it done. I'm just being straight honest with you guys. Um, so, yeah. And before I go, this is all the packaging that everything, everything came in, every package, all the packaging is, everything is packaged well so all i can say is thumbs up on the packaging and if if and when i get the hair installed into my head i will give you guys a live review if i'm able to again if the girl whoever i have do my hair if dolls is um camera not camera shy or if i'm going to a salon i'll try to do my camera there um but I'll give you guys updates on everything. It's like I said, it won't be no time soon. I will definitely give you guys my opinion and my honest opinion on everything that I got. Again, um, I appreciate them for letting me do this review for them. Because um, not, a, not a lot of us divas are um, able to do things for companies and whatnot. Uh, it's like I said, it's just... It come a lot. I'm gonna try to get to that status, but I'm not gonna be big headed about it. I'm still gonna continue to do my thing, um, whether it be makeup, photography, or whatever. It's not going to be any with you guys because you guys are my family. You guys support my channel. Again, this here is my um, show and tell review on the products that I received today. Again, um, I will post all the links below. Uh, don't forget to comment and subscribe. Also follow me on Twitter, Facebook, and whatnot. All my channels are listed on my main channel. I uh, thank you for allowing me to do a review. Ally and Prices. Uh, Ally Express. I am going to get the name right eventually. I do apologize. I do appreciate everything. And again, thank you for allowing me to give you guys a live review on the products that I did receive. Stay tuned. I will try to get that video up on the um hair installation and everything but on the time being i will keep you guys posted on other tutorials and whatnot so yeah have a great day guys bye